Hey, what's up, good people? How you doing? Welcome back to Stock Up with Larry Jones. Uh, listen, on today's video, I am going to concentrate on Shiba Inu and uh, why I think it's going to come back roaring and probably surpass last year's all-time highs. And I also believe that Dogecoin will do the same. I'm going to call these legacy memes, okay? That's what I'm going to call them legacy memes i believe that these legacy memes not only will they be back but they will be a safer investment or trade should i say uh because they have a proven track record for those of you that are new to the page my name is larry jones this is stock over larry jones please uh come and join the family by hitting the like subscribe and the notification bell so you can get the best of all now, you're going to hear nothing when these coins are down and you hear a lot about them once they are running. I, and uh, unlike a lot of uh, influencers, like to talk about them when they're trading sideways or when they're beat down so you could get in like I did in 2021 and then you could make money with us, okay? And so I'm gonna play this for you guys and I want you to listen to something Look at this. I recorded this six months ago after Shiba Inu got hit again and went down. I want you guys to listen. Let's go into why I bought more Shiba Inu even last night. There was an FTX, right, dump, and it caused Shiba Inu to go down back six months ago, right? So that would be October from here. So now if we go back to October, we can see here, I got it on the daily. If you go back to October, you will see that there's all these zeros, one, two, three, four, five zeros and a seven. Now, if you remember me suggesting that that was a buy range for all of the zeros in a seven, leave me a comment. So I suggested that I was buying in this price range. I said I was buying in this price range. Now, I don't have all my money in this. 80% of my money is in stocks, right? And then the 20% that I have in crypto, 80% of that are in Bitcoin and layer ones. I just want to keep this straight. So we're not YOLOing everything into a meme coins. But again, you guys know I made a lot of money in 2021 by knowing when to buy and when to sell, right? So I wanna share with you guys why I think these are going. This is after it sold off a little more. Now, if you look at the bottom, you can see my average costs are all of the zeros and six, eight. So it dumped down, my average cost was zeros, all these zeros and six, eight, right? But you could also see that my initial investment again was 2370 2370 right but you can also see that i have a total profit of 73 uh 7300 okay so i'm up 309 percent even now that it has cooled off right and so i believe that this could actually shiba inu could drop another zero so you see those five zeros, when five zeros, let's say you have five zeros and a seven. If you have five zeros and a seven and it turns to four zeros and a seven, you have just 10 X. You have made a thousand percent. I'm going to keep saying that because you guys are going to be flooded with Shiba Inu to the moon. Look at this. I want to show you right now. This was 11 hours ago. Shiba Inu skyrockets 60% in burn rate. I'm right. going to continue to tell you guys that this stuff is irrelevant. It, look at this. Shiba Inu received support by this popular crypto platform. All of this stuff that pumps, pumps, pumps. And that's not why it grows. And I'm telling you it's going to go higher than where it is now. I believe, right? These are not facts. This is what I believe. I'm telling you guys that is just, it's proven, it has a track record, and I'm going to give you the keys to why. Here's my deep, deep fundamental uh, uh, thesis on why I believe Shiba Inu 
will explode again because of last cycle. Because most people that are going to buy these memes have never heard of Floki. They've never heard of Whiff, right? They've never heard of Bunk. They've never heard of uh, none of these memes, Pepe. They don't know what this is, right? Now, a lot of people do, but most of the people with the bigger wallets or the deeper pockets, they are going to go back when they hear this stuff is taking off and they are going to first buy what? The legacy memes. I heard that, I heard that dog coin is taking off again. And that's what will happen. And that's why Shiba Inu and Doge have been some of the most stable as far as movement memes. Okay, so we could see right here at the time of filming this, uh, Sheeb is up 2.43, but Sheeb is having a bad week and Sheeb is also having a, 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 an even worse month, right? So let's compare that to Doge. Now Doge is up to date in the last hour, 7% in the last day, down, let's call that 10% for the week, but for the month, Doge is actually up 26%. Why? Doge, remember, had a, had a earlier cycle than sheep. So Doge is the more stable uh, legacy meme, right? And then comes Shiba Inu, okay? So just, to, just so we can look at it, let's look at one of the newer memes, Bunk. Bunk is up, right? But for the day, it's up 3%, right? Great. 16% down for the week and for the month, down 12%, okay? So look at that. Shiba Inu is down 10% for the month, right? And um, Bunk is down, look at that, 12.77%. Now, I'll say this. I'm going to say this. Bunk will probably explode and go higher than Sheeb and Doge. It will. I believe it will. The newer ones have bigger falls, but they have bigger ramp ups. But if you're looking for stability, you're going to find that more in Dogecoin and Sheeb. If I bought this, this was a zero and this was a seven. If this moves over one and we drop another zero, that's a thousand percent good people. That's a 10 X on your bags. Why do you keep telling us this? Because I don't want you to be chasing Shiba Inu to a penny. I don't want you to be chasing Shiba Inu to five cent. You're going to see that get pump, pump, pump. Listen, concentrate on what you can do with a thousand percent. That's why I simply go in and talk about things when it's beat down I buy it when it's beat down like this video. It probably won't get much traction. Why? Because it's been trading sideways. It's boring now. But then when it's up by 35 and 40 percent, then, of course, you're going to see the new talking mouths four zeros to eight. But if we just go back to last cycle, look at the spike. Look at all the room we have to grow when the people that tapped out, remember, there's a lot of people that still holding Shiba Inu that were down. What do you think when is going to happen when we start to get back above this? Actually, when we start to get in this zone, even people are going to start buying up again. And I believe that we could drop another zero that will come after what Bitcoin is above 80 and holding. Above 80 and holding, you're going to see big, major moves on these memes. So now, Larry, what is the right path to take to this, right? The right path to take is to buy when it's low and sell when it's high. And when the fear and greed is, uh, when fear is up high, that's when you buy. And when greed is up high, that's when you sell. You literally can just buy and sell off of this chart if you're swinging 
But if you got it low and you bought it low like I did, then you simply hold. I had a lot of people asking me uh, back six to, to six to seven months ago, hey, when should I buy? When should I buy? I said, don't touch it until it dips to seven and, and under. And that has proven to be right. Now, what about now? We're kind of neutral right now in the fear and greed index if you really look at it and, and dive down into it. So when it's neutral, I'm neutral. When it goes to extreme greed, then I'm looking to take a little profit, right? But in extreme fear, now that I still think Bitcoin is going to go up, that's when I buy and I continue to dollar cost average into extreme fear. Follow? And so what you could do is just look at easy. You don't need any fancy chart. Just look at where it's been over the last month. Look at where the lows are, right? Look at where the lows are over the last month. And that will tell you where you should be buying, right? Should you be buying here at uh, three, five? No. Should you be buying here at two, six? Yes. See here, should you, should you have bought at three, two? No. Should you buy at two, six? Yes. Right. And so then you still have what's called a breakdown and you got to keep an eye on Bitcoin to see if Bitcoin is starting to break down. If Bitcoin starts to really break down, then you should have a, a stop loss or you just need to sell at some point if it's a breakdown. But right now, there's no breakdown. Bitcoin is range bound, been trading sideways and so have all of the meme coins. OK, so that's what I wanted to share with you. And as you could see, um, uh, Dogecoin is doing the same thing, except Dogecoin is even more stable. Right. It is a legacy uh, coin. And it is more more stable. You guys know <laughs> if I had to pick the two, I just like sheep. But this year we got to look at what is what what these coins are showing us and what the market is showing us. What the market is showing us is Doge has been one of the more stable meme coins over the last month. So, yes, when it went down, I have buy orders to buy more. When Sheeb goes down, I have buy orders to buy more. And when they come up, I don't buy. Dumb money. I'm sorry. That's not what I'm calling you. It's what Wall Street calls you. Dumb money is buying. And we already bought at the bottom. We bought last year, right? And guess what, good people? If you miss this time, same thing happens in about four years, okay? But... Some of these newer meme coins are really going to dance. So if you're really looking into some of the newer meme coins, you better be looking for the ones that are beat down the most. I'm going to leave it right there. Listen, I want you guys to be careful. There's a lot of spammers out there um, uh, because I'm talking about crypto yet again. There's going to be spam in the comment section. Never send money or crypto to any really want to kill it in crypto and stock. Make sure you click the link. And listen, I am going to put yet another lesson into the crypto chapter of the course, right? Now's the time to be studying and invest in yourself, right? So I'm going to stop while I have a piece of a voice left over. Man, allergy season, this happens every year for me, all right? But tell me what you think about Shiba Inu, all right, and Doge. Don't, we're not talking about all of the million other coins. Yeah, Larry, but what about this? What about that? I just made this for Shiba Inu and Dogecoin. I do believe that both of these coins will yet rise and pass last cycle's high. And even if they move from where they are now to last cycle's high, that's a lot of money. And you better be thinking about where you're going to be taking some profits. The question is not where can I get in? I just showed you guys. It's not how much can I make. It is what is my exit plan the day that I buy these coins? Because these mean coins are not investments. They are trades. OK, so if you want to continue to kill it in crypto, take the class, right? Take the course and kill it in uh, with stocks. But also, too, it's free to just hit that notification bell and come here. Right. We'll 
We'll talk to you guys later. Peace.